Hey guys, how are you? Happy Saturday. Hope you guys have a great weekend. I know I'll probably say it at the end of the video, but it is Saturday, very early morning, like probably 2 o'clock in the morning or maybe going on 2. But I found something that is so funny because this tissue paper is purple. Okay, now it's coming off purple. Okay, that was weird because first it was pink. I was like, am I going all right? I was so mad, y'all. I found... I mailed a thank you because, you know, that's just how I am. And so I mailed a thank you and um, I forgot a couple things. So I'm, there's going to be like a continuation. But anyways, so I have a um, Etsy haul from Design Creative Bling you guys thank you phone design creative bling all spaced out and I just got a few items the first item I got is this lawn fawn and it's a clear stamp and it's like the gingham I don't know if this is the one that I wanted but I just went ahead and got it and it says life's a picnic oh happy day and hello there was one that how however you stamped it it just made a really cool gingham print, but I can't remember whose video. I don't know if it was on Karen's Corner on her channel or if it was somebody else's. I don't know, but anyway, I got that one to satisfy the need for gingham. And then, I think this was like the only one. Who is this by? Let's see. Cartabella. So Cartabella and this has the red truck. Looks like a fire truck, doesn't it? Without my glasses. And it's got the little pumpkin in the middle. So I got that. Guess I can leave the gingham over there. It's a very small. Then there was this one that had the orange pumpkin, teal pumpkin, and white pumpkin upside down, Kim. So I had to get that. And these were all on sale, I want to say, but I don't remember the prices. These were like maybe $3. I don't know if this was $7. I'm not sure. If I could have found that on AliExpress, you know, darn toot, and I would have got it. Okay, where's the last thing? So the last thing I went ahead and got, because I don't have a lot of, like, Thanksgiving-ish paper. I have Halloween. I mean, not like tons of it, but I have it. So this is by who? Cartabella again. And this is a six by six. This is called Fall Market. And it matches perfect with the little pumpkins. Oh look, the red truck's there too. Isn't that cool? So let me see if I, hopefully I can do, oh, it's double-sided. I can't stand double-sided paper. So that's got leaves. I don't know what in the world that is. I guess it's like window boxes. And then that side is just orange hexagons and circles and stripes the wagons like wheat or something whoops it's like some little tags and there's the red truck I swear with my glasses it looks like a fire truck that is so funny the wood grain hopefully you guys can see because the the paper pad doesn't want to, uh, and that's got some little white dots on it. And those pumpkins again with that platy kind of print. What are those? Feathers? No, leaves, Kim. And that has little prints on that. Oop, I must drop my phone. So that almost reminds me of Beetlejuice for some reason. So now they look like hats. I swear my lenses. Well, this paper pad's got an attitude. Oh, and then we're going back again. So it must. Yep. So we are going back to the beginning. Oh, that's kind of pretty. I didn't remember seeing that one. Oh, the Beetlejuice one again. That's cool. A lot going on. I need to work more with um, pattern paper. I think I let it scare me for some reason. 
But anyway, that is, um, yep, I think that's only, yeah, that's only, that's only the things, um, the few things that I got from there. And, um, I guess that is it. I'm looking around just to make sure, but yeah, my, my bag is empty. So, everybody, thanks for stopping by and commenting and liking and hitting the bell if you'd like to see when my crazy self comes on. And I guess I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a blessed and happy weekend, and I will see you when I see you. You might see me later today. I do not know. You just never know. I should show you guys the the the, the, the watermelons and the cantaloupes. I lost a lot of cantaloupes, though, because of the heat. Yeah. Go figure, but I'm enjoying one humongous watermelon. I tried to give a watermelon away today, and it, and I mean yesterday, and I got a no. Of course, it's from a man, and he doesn't eat watermelon. <laughs> oh, goodness. And see, I, my, my friends, you know, who don't talk to me anymore, they're probably a little sad that they don't talk to me anymore because they could get a free watermelon. Mm-hmm. Yes, indeedy. They're lost. Alrighty, guys. I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a blessed one. And I'll see you when I see you. Bye.